Well, it's critical for every patient who comes to see us to try and understand truly what is their risk of progression, but also which drugs will matter for them the most. So if I see a patient today with smoldering myeloma, I want to tell them, are they truly high risk? And that's biologically, not just clinically, not just tumor burden. Do they have a 17P deletion or do they have an 1114 translocation? Would they benefit from venetoclax or would they benefit from a bispecific or a CAR-T or from three drug combinations or four drug combinations? These are all questions questions that will matter for each patient and we try to make sure that that precision is critical for them for their risk stratification but also for the interception that we use and the beauty of it is we're now reinventing myeloma therapy from scratch because we don't have to follow the model of their RVD or RVD for everyone multiple myeloma is not one disease why are we treating it as one disease now we have an opportunity in smoldering myeloma to truly ask the question in a biological fashion and really intercept in our patients in a precise way so that not every patient will get the same treatment.